my objective here is to work with a media set that consists of three archived projects. Each project will be loaded into Camtasia Studio. A few edits will be made, then the project will be sent to library as a sequence asset. I'll do that for all three projects. After all three projects are in the library, I'll send them back to the timeline in a new project altogether to create a single large project. I'll start off by dragging and dropping the first project archive into Camtasia Studio. I'll use Control F9 so I can view the entire project. There's a hot spot at the end of this project. I don't need that for combining all these projects together. So I'm going to select that and delete it. I note that there's also a hot spot at the beginning of this project. However, let me zoom out a little bit. That's a start arrow hotspot, and I will use that in the combined project. So I'm going to leave that alone. Once again, Control F9. This time, making sure the playhead is at T equals zero. Control Shift End key to select the entire project. Navigate to library. Let's close that folder. Right click. Add playhead section to library. And I'll call this 01 so I keep track of where I am. Enter key. I'll repeat the process for the second archive. I'll drag it and drop it into Camtasia Studio. Let me do a Control F9 so we can look at the entire project. And let me do some zooming here just a little bit. At the beginning of this project, there is a start arrow, which I'm not going to need if I combine the projects. So I'll select that and delete it. Next, I'll send the playhead to the end of the project. Control N key and I back off one frame. There's a an arrow here that's basically a hotspot. I'm not going to need that in the combined projects either. So I need to expand this group. There's my hotspot. I'll select it and delete it. Again, Control F9. Control Home to send the playhead to T equals zero. Now I'm going to select the entire project. Control Shift End key. Select the library tab. Right click. Add playhead selection to library. And I'll call this sequence 02. Enter key. I'll follow the same procedure for the third archive. Drag it and drop it into Camtasia Studio. Again, Control F9 so I can see the whole project. I'll zoom a little bit. I don't need the start arrow. Select it. Delete it. Control N to send the playhead to the end of the project. Open this group. Here I have an arrow. I don't want this arrow. I'm going to use a different ending. So I'm going to select this and delete it. Control F9. Control Home. And I'll send this project to the library. Control Shift N key. I'll navigate to the library tab. Right click. Add playhead selection to library. And I'll call this asset 03 Enter key. Final step in this process involves selecting all the projects, right click, and add them to the timeline. After the three projects have loaded on the timeline, it's Control F9. Then I'll select everything on the timeline, Control U to ungroup. The last thing I have to do is make the final edits before producing. In this case, I have to replace the missing transitions at the junctions of the separate projects. That would be here and here. 
and I'm going to create a different ending callout to take care of the end of the project. Once that's done, it's a matter of simply producing the composite project.